Welcome to Pastime Tech. My name is Teddy, and tonight we're looking at a Panasonic VCR. It's model number PVV4603. All right, let's take a look at this one. I'm going to start off with the remote. This remote not only is immaculate, but it has one of these um, shuffle um, shuffle knobs on it, which I always I always approve of those. It, interestingly enough, it doesn't have one on the VCR too. I've, I've usually they it's in both places. You also can use your regular your regular fast forward buttons too, but it's an interesting, you know, little feature. I had to buy this remote separately and I had to pay a lot for it too. So I already, did I turn the unit on? No, oh, I already had it on. Allow me to turn it on again. All right, let's take a look at the back. All right, what do we got here? We got my favorite kind of sticker that has, um, the, you know, of course the model number again, which it does have two V's indeed. But it also tells us this was made on May 12th, 2003. I like it when it says that. Um, let's go over here. Also, also the back, the model number adds an S to it. So um, I'm not sure why that is sometimes. It just, they do that sometimes. If anyone knows why they do that, please leave that in the comments. Okay, so it's a very simple, like with Panasonic's usually pretty simple, especially ones of this vintage. They're, you know, we, we have, you have composite cables, composite connections, and they, we have an out and we have an in, and we're using the out right now to do this demonstration, and you have your antenna connections, all right? Let's go back, oops, sorry about that, let's go back around to the front. It feels like my phone board's not moving right, but it's just, I don't know why. Oh, it's getting focused, focus, okay. All right, so it's on. We got the move, where'd the move, oh, I have the movie in there, whoops. Let me take the movie back out. I was just making sure the movie has that right spot. Okay, so let's put the, oh, we're good, yeah. Let's put the movie in and take a look at this unit in action. All right, oh, I don't have a quick center, but that's okay. There we go, I'm gonna use the, uh, the fast forward and rewind dial for a second here. Shuffle, oh, I guess you gotta, you gotta not put too much, too much on it. All right, and then let's let go. And then it pauses it. Okay, so let's hit, let's hit play. That's interesting. And let's do the rewind on it. I can't keep both in focus, folks. So there we go. And then it, it'll pause it again. Yeah, it pauses again. Okay, all right. So that's how that works. Now let's just use the normal right now and uh, get through this demonstration. So. I'm going to demonstrate that this unit can change modes so we know that the gears and electronics are working in sync properly. So let's do, I uh, always like to do pause. Uh, where's pause on this thing? Ooh, I can't find pause. Well, we know pause works just from, there's a pause down here. The pause is like all the way down here. Okay, so we know pause works already. Let's hit play. Play fast forward, which we already did see. All right. Play rewind. There we go. Oops. I'm sorry I'm so off center. I was looking at the remote. All right, we're good. And it is that little black and white thing when you rewind too, interesting enough. That's, uh, all right, so let's hit stop, fast forward. It's near the end of the tape, so that's why it didn't rev up too much. Oh, it's like after the whole impact thing. Huh? Stop, rewind. I assume it's moving a lot. Play. There we go. I'm gonna let that rev up a little bit more. There we go, that's good. Play again. Oh, there we go. So clearly this model is in really great working order. You don't have to worry about that. Um, and if I show too much of this, I'll make it copyright strike. So I don't think I'm going to, but that's a really powerful scene right there. All right, and let's see, is it, oh, the ejects on the remote. That's cool, I always like that. So I'll show you that this did not eat the tape. Perfect. And then let's put in the Tominator. Finish up here. There we go. Got a really great 
picture. Panasonic's, they always have great pictures and they're very sturdy units that last. So, all right, so let's go ahead and stop that. And uh, all right, so if, if you're interested in purchasing this unit, um, the link is in the description. Um, please like, comment, subscribe, that would be awesome. Um, everyone's been really generous with the subscriptions and I hope that continues. And if you're in the market for tech, which is past its time, please come back and see what I feature next. Have a great evening.